What's up gamers, GamerDad here. This is a guide to help you complete the Triggerfish quest, collect area scans from research equipment, and then deliver area scans to Triggerfish. If you haven't already subscribed, please hit that button, show me that support as well. Please do use my creator code in your Fortnite item shop. It is GamerDad, all one word, all capital letters. Thank you so much for your support. So there's two parts to this stage four of four quest. First off, um, you've just you're gotten to frenzy fields now you've delivered the coral sample now you need to collect the area scans from the research equipment it's now been analyzed so the area scans are going to be right there you should already be in this little shack slash building at frenzy fields and after placing that coral sample on there you just immediately will pick up um the area scan so you push or you hold the square button collect the area scans and then it will flip into the second part of this stage four quest, which is to deliver these area scans to Triggerfish. So if you want, got any augments, make sure you're using augments that are going to assist you with the quest. And then, of course, as you see here, it just flips over. Um, I honestly just wish they had one quest line that said collect them and deliver why they have to like separate it this way. It's kind of annoying for me, but hey. So for this part, you are already at Frenzy Fields, and now you need to go back to Triggerfish. He's way over there on the coast, just west of Shattered Slabs. Now, if you look here, you can see that that area is already in the storm. And so at this point, I was like, yeah, what the heck? No big deal. I'll just go there anyways. Um, and so I'm going to head out of here. And then now I'm basically going to go by metal mansion here and that's because i intended on grabbing the dirt bikes of course someone starts shooting at me and in fact i so i eliminate them and then i can also hear and see that someone else is shooting at me still i guess those two people were fighting before i showed up so eliminate those two jokers um i decide to take this raptor but to be honest i do prefer the dirt bike to the raptor um just in case the raptor also gets tired i'm not gonna have that problem with the dirt bike so i'm gonna quickly stop here Grab those slap, uh, the slap juice there. And I was about to leave on the dirt bikes and I decided, you know what the heck, I'm going to get one of my other quests at the same time. So I basically eliminate all three of these uh, bosses, the boss and the two henchmen here. And I don't even bother with the vault. I'm honestly just focused on the quest. I really just wanted to get those eliminations and pick up that gold. So I'm going to hop back on the dirt bike and then make a you know, a hasty exit out of here and get over to where a trigger fish should be. Now, I'm not going to lie here. My memory may be serving me incorrectly here, but I did expect that I would show up and trigger fish would still be here and would be alive. Um, but as you're going to see, and this is what you do, like, so hopefully for you when you're doing this, you're not in the storm. Um, and if you are, you can give it a go and you can comment down below. Let me know if it worked out for you when you went in the storm. But I was hoping that Triggerfish would be still kicking it here. But unfortunately, when I do get here, I do discover that Triggerfish is not there. Now, it's possible that the storm killed Triggerfish. I honestly can't remember off the top of my head now if the NPCs survive in the storm or not. But clearly at this point, I didn't see that, you know, the speech bubble. So all I really did was... I just loaded up a second, uh, another game, and I just land, come here straight off the battle bus. So the nice thing is, once you collect them, you don't actually have to repeat it if you're unable to deliver. So that's a sweet thing. You can just start up a new match if you die, or if Triggerfish isn't here. You can land here straight off of the battle bus. One thing I would recommend if you're landing here right off the battle bus, is that you should loot the area first. So get those chests and pick up any ground loot, like this over here, just so that someone else doesn't drop in right after you pick up that loot and then potentially kill you so up here chat with trigger fish and then it's this challenge will be complete so i do hope the guide is helpful please drop a like leave me a comment and if you haven't already subscribed please hit that button show me that support as well please do use my creator code in your fortnite item shop it is gamer dad all one word all capital letters thanks for your support good luck with your challenge and until the next video this is gamer dad out